Okay, so uh, there have been a lot of times over the, uh, I don't know, years, however long this whole thing has been around, this YouTube thing, people doing vlogs. Does anybody call it vlogging? Vlogging? Does anybody call it vlogging anymore? The main thing is this. The main thing is this. Today, I decided to hire myself. I decided just to, just to do this, just to do this, whatever this is, and just to, whether it's inspiring or babbling or getting things off my chest. I don't know. I don't know what it's going to be. Here's what I want to do. What I want to do is I want to do something. And this is it. Right now, I, I don't know what it's going to be. I just want it to be more than once. A couple years ago, a year ago, two, three years ago, I don't know. I, I set out to do this and I had a theme. It was going to be a, a Monday morning quarterback. Yeah, I did one. I did one! Then I come up with all these excuses, like, oh, here was the latest one. What I wrote today was I thought, who's going to want to watch some, uh, just some average 50-year-old guy or gal? I mean, really, who says gal anymore, except maybe a 50-year-old guy? Older? 70? 80? You know the thing I like about 70 and 80-year-old people is they call me kid. Age is an excuse. That was going to be my excuse. That's what I wrote about today, and that's what I was going to talk about today. Because most of the time when I watch these things, I, I watch a lot of uh, a lot of YouTube channels, and it, I, I watch those with my daughters. And my daughters are young compared to me. They tend to watch a lot of younger people. I, I thought, well, maybe age has something to do with it. Mm, I'm not so sure. Content? Does content matter? To an extent, I guess. How about quality? Because like right now, uh, I know this is not good quality. It's on a webcam. My lips aren't exactly synced up with my mouth. That That's the kind of thing that I, I think doesn't really matter. I've seen some really popular uh, internet celebrities. No production value at all. Maybe, 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 and I'm not saying that in a negative way. I'm just saying it doesn't matter. Mind Taffy comes to mind. There's this uh, newsletter on uh, one of the uh, acting websites, and uh, this casting director talks about uh, actor Mind Taffy. But it, it applies to everybody. It's not just about actors. Mind Taffy. It's that stuff that we constantly think and worry about that really has nothing to do with anything. Like this. Does it really matter if I'm recording this on a webcam? What matters is doing it. <laughs> That's the main thing, is to do it. And the rest is Mind Taffy. Like I'm thinking right now, I'm thinking, you know, I'm just babbling incoherently. Okay, maybe coherently, but without a lot of content. I've seen a lot of channels like that too. I think it really boils down to something that uh, William Goldman said. And again, this is related to the entertainment industry when he said it, but I think it applies to everything. Nobody knows anything. And what he was really saying, at least the, what I interpret it is, you can do all the market research you want, all of the focus groups, surveys, whatever, tarot cards, palm reading, and nobody knows anything. What, do you think do You think uh, Disney or Sony or any of the big people, you think they'd be putting out stuff that, that loses money? Uh, not all of it, but you know, not everything they do makes money, right? But if they knew how to make money every time, <clears throat> don't you think they'd do it? It's all a crapshoot. You just keep doing stuff, you put it out there, and nobody knows anything. So all this worrying about oh, whether or not you're going to have a lot, of, a lot of people watching or caring what you're doing, mm, you, I guess you got to care about that if you're going to have a career, right? But I think it's putting the, the cart before the horse, which really I think we need to update that slogan because how many people use carts and horses anymore, right? Just do something. Do something. Be true to yourself. And I hope I don't sound preachy here, because I'm really talking to me, not to you, okay? In fact, likely, that's pretty much all I'm going to be talking to, except maybe a couple of my Facebook friends. It's been the perennial thing throughout history that artists and uh, artistry and, and commerce are, are like uh, part, partners, but they've got this love-hate relationship. I mean, on the one hand, the artist... Uh, wants to be pure and do something because it's 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 in his heart and it's something he's passionate about. And then on the other hand, he you know it would be nice to make a living at it, right? But then at what point does the artist begin to sell out and do something that he or she doesn't really 
believe in in order to make money. And then that's where you get into that. Okay, I don't know what you get into, but the point is this. Right now, I'm going to, um, when I, aside from today, aside from today, which is this first and hopefully not last, whatever this is, I don't plan on talking about uh, why I'm doing this or whether or not to do this. I'll actually have a topic. You know what? I don't know. Maybe not. Maybe I'll do just do like I'm doing today and turn on the camera and start talking. Because face it, when it comes right down to why some people do channels that are popular and some people's channels are not popular, nobody knows anything. So I guess I should really stop concerning myself with that, right? <laughs>